the name suggests, Flexbox containers are flexible boxes that contain your page's content. The Flexbox container allows you to efficiently build your page, design it, and adjust it for different screen sizes. In this video, we'll explain what Flexbox containers are, go over their benefits, and discuss what you should expect when working with containers. When you open the Elementor editor, you'll start with a blank canvas. In order to build a web page, you'll first need to create a layout. The layout is a grid that you can place your content on. This is where the Flexbox container comes into play. You drag a Flexbox container to the canvas, placing it wherever you want to add content later on. Each container you'll add creates a new content area on the page. Flexbox containers help you make the most of each such content area. You'll enjoy the flexibility to customize the container's width, height, and location. You can also place containers inside one another while still designing each container separately. Many other benefits unfold with Flexbox containers. Flexbox containers allow you to create beautiful and intricate layouts with ease. Once you've created your layout, you can add your site's content by simply dragging widgets. Flexbox containers also allow you to rearrange widgets and set their position with top-level control. That means you can organize and align all widgets at once with settings that define gaps and position for everything inside the container. Creating layouts seamlessly is one of the main features of Flexbox containers, and it's extremely effective for a number of reasons. First, it's easier for you to create a responsive design. This way, your users can properly view your content across different screen sizes. Another reason is that it creates code-efficient pages, which improve your site's speed and general performance. This is an important aspect for your user's experience and for search engine discoverability. Flexbox containers also allow you to achieve pixel-perfect designs with minimal effort. And once you get the hang of them, containers allow you to design and even reorganize elements efficiently, which improves your workflow. Another great feature of containers is that you can reuse them as templates across your site. You can save each container you create as a template. You can then upload the container as a template from your library to any part of your site. You can do this with simple containers that hold widgets or with an entire page. The ability to use containers as templates can significantly improve your site creation workflow. Containers allow you to quickly create the layout and to add content to your page. That said, we highly recommend taking a few minutes to learn and understand the internal logic of the Flexbox container methodology. If you overlook this step, you could stumble across a few scenarios in which clicking the top-level positioning buttons will seem to have no effect on what actually happens on your canvas. Below this video, you'll find a link to the complete guide to mastering Flexbox containers so you can learn how containers work, understand best practices, avoid common mistakes, and build a pixel-perfect, professional-looking website that will help you reach your goals.